marrying a soldier or a civilian marrying a soldier is one of the best things a woman can think of. Oh, wow. Yes. Or is one of the best things a civilian can think of marrying a female officer. Let me tell you, that's an institution where you have the highest respect. Even if you are not a soldier, a phone call will come in. Even as a civil servant, a phone call will come in. True. So if you have made up your mind to marry a soldier, go in mm -hmm. with all totality. Yes, there are prunes of it. True. But this same prunes are everywhere, mm -hmm. in every job. So I tell women, allow yourself to this opportunity. Yes, the man is on the front line. Try to give the society a safe environment. Likewise, yourself back home. But let me tell you, with that hardship, thank God for the wall of GSM. When we were in Sierra Leone, there was nothing like that. But this time you call. A soldier cannot sleep without calling his family. He may get angry with the next environment because he has not made phone call. Again, for if an officer like us that has married a civilian, the man is there because before he married you, he knows the kind of job you do. So bringing him into every activities that the military have, your husband is there, feeling important. So I don't, I don't, see, I don't see marriage as something that would make young ones to say, I don't want to marry an officer. Go in for them. They are the best. Oh, wow. Yeah, I See, no, I, I agree. <laughs> no, I agree. I had the best father. <laughs> okay. Except that he, he wasn't, wasn't present. <laughs>